Hello, happy Monday. Um, I think I figured out why we had so much bad luck last week. <laughs> Today wasn't any better. <laughs> but, um, a while back, I dropped this on the floor and broke it. Pow! The mirror. It's the mirror's fault. I actually need to throw it away because it's getting ready to all fall out. Need to buy me a new one. I'm sure the Dollar Tree can get me another one. Hello, there's my screen. The lighthouse. Overlook on an ocean. Yeah. You get ready to go? Yeah, I got my beans all ready to go to Monday Night Football. He's taking beans the weenies. They can all get gas. Party each other out. Okie dokie, lock the door when you go. I got some Christmas cards to show you. One here of a little Santa Claus. Oh, not a snowman. Not a Santa Claus. This was from Teresa Heidi and her husband Brad. Thank you, lady. She makes some pretty scarves. I'm going to wear the infinity one she made me Wednesday for our Christmas party dinner for the employees. Okie dokie, see ya! Okay. Um, I'm gonna wear a pink v neck like this. And that's got pink in it along with the teal. You'll see. I'll vlog that day. Okie dokie! This is from one Mr. Scott Faithful. Thank you, Mr. Faithful. And then I got the bill for my, my insurance. Uh, that is the one bad part about your income going up every year is uh, your tax credit isn't as much. And uh, every year my tax credit has gotten less and my premium has gotten more. But I can't complain. I pay under $200 a month. And I have insurance. So... It is what it is. Also, I got a box. I have sliced it open, but I have not delved into it. Um, so we shall see what it is. It is giant bubble wrap, which might come in handy in the next couple days for, for something I might need it for. We'll just leave it right in this box. A red card. And... Uh, a thing. A, hang on. I can't do two things at once. Get on the desk, box. How difficult can that be? Apparently very difficult. Let's open the card first, shall we? Very pretty. Thinking of you and hoping your Christmas is everything you want it to be. Have a very Merry Christmas to you and the Humber, Paul. And Edie. Oh, Zesty211. Because I saw the um, name on there. I'm like, do I know Paul? But I know Zesty211. This is how I wrap stuff in paper bags. Really, I do. And brown. What is this? What is this? Light me up. How do I light it up? How do I do it? How do I? Tell me. Tell me. Light me up. White LED light strand with battery pack included. What do I gotta do? What do I gotta do? Oh, okay. Apparently, I've never had battery operated lights before. How do I? Hang on. Let's see here. How does this work? They package everything so difficult. Okay. There is the lights. What's 43 strand add 
twinkle to your home decor requires two double A batteries, which I happen to have right up here. Come here, batteries. My batteries are right there. Okay, let's see. Now, how do I open this thing? Everything's so difficult. Okay, we'll go down. Aha, I figured it out. Batteries are ran away. We put negative that way. We put negative this way. Ooh, ooh, twinkly lights. Pop this back on. Somehow, there it goes. It's got an on and off switch. So I gotta untangle the legs. This whole video is just gonna be you watching me try to figure this out. Tomorrow, I might have an out and about video. So this goes in here, right? But what do I. And then shut the back. Take off the sticker. Okay. And then it's, um, let me turn off the light. Hang on. It's going to go dark. It's just saying. I got to find a place to hang this. Oh, I see. I can put the battery pack maybe here where you can get the switch maybe no, I guess you just have to let me hung well I guess if you hung it you would just no trying to figure it out I think this is gonna end up sitting on a shelf instead of being hung even though it has a hanging option but if you hang it it'd be difficult to get to this Ta-da! Thank you so much, guys. Oh, it has little bumper feet. You can just set it somewhere. Where am I going to set it? I'll figure it out. i got to find a spot on my shelf. I think it's going to end up going on this side of the room. I need to reduce some of those, those shelves. Although I'm going to turn off the battery for right now so I don't wear it down. Wow. That's so cute. Okay, I took off the thing. I love it. I might even go in the living room. There is a bookshelf next to the Christmas tree. After the Christmas season when the tree's gone, I can put it. I think I know where I'm gonna put it. Thank you guys. That is cool beans. Cool. I'm gonna put it back in the box. The box that I'm dropping. Okay, you're going over here. Box. Um, what else was I gonna tell you? Dad delivered a couple of my treat containers today. Um, I had a text early this morning from my cousin Casey, who had come over to help do candy and fudge and stuff. And um, my uncle Skip was put in the hospital for pneumonia again. Not as bad, not in the ICU. He'll probably go home tomorrow, hopefully. So dad took his treat container and the one for Casey and then he took his sister Jenny's and he went up to the hospital. He said, Skip looked really good. He said, as soon as I gave him the container, he was opening up and getting some out to eat, some candy out to eat. And uh, then Casey was coming in when he was there, so he gave her. And then after he left there, he went, got his sister, took her out for lunch, gave her the treats. So, while he was gone, I watched A Coat of Many Colors. Good movie. I enjoyed it. And, um, Ronnie's been keeping me in the loop about what's going on with the bank. He had to give him a couple more things, and hopefully tomorrow we'll know more. And sign papers soon. I, he knows tomorrow I'm going to be maybe gone shopping. Uh don't quite know what time yet. Uh, 
I'm not 100% sure if grandma's gonna go yet or not. I'll get a call in the morning. So it's all kind of just up in the air. We'll find out. But now I'm gonna roll out, go in, get me some dinner and watch uh, the rest of a movie I was watching. It was another Christmas movie my dad recorded. I don't know what it's called. One of the like Hallmark or Lifetime channel ones. I don't know. And uh, just chill. I already got my clothes sitting in the bathroom for tomorrow morning for shower time. Because today I stayed in my jammies all day. Just pulled my hair up. I didn't even brush it out. I just pulled it all up this morning. So it's probably a rat's nest in there. But I ain't got nobody to impress. Kitty, did you want to come say anything? She's actually right here, right there. Hi, are you into shadows? She's like, you put a box in my box and I don't like it. All right, 11 minutes, gotta go, bye.